What's up guys? It's Ben here. I want to do a quick video on the 164th stuff. Haven't done a video in a little while. I don't know, about a couple months. And this isn't going to be super detailed. It's just going to be kind of an update. And um, as I start to work on these here and there a little bit more, I'll get you guys some more videos. First off, I finally found the uh, green light dually drivers. That's kind of what got me back into doing this. Um, well, we could start with the junkyard here. Um, I'm not going to go through everything. I'll just kind of give you a pass over. A little tire area. I got some vehicles over here. All that crap. A dirt bike and some of my other trucks. My skid steer, which I love this thing. Um, I did get the little 164th cat skid steers, but I, I couldn't switch this thing out. This has been my go-to for many years and... Uh, as you can see, I wore all the tread off of it and put a little motor in the back there. This one has the attachments off of a uh, a little cat. Um, I've got the bucket, grapple, and another bucket over there. Uh, one of the main trucks I use to haul the scrap cars with is that Dodge right there. And I got a couple other cool things with some Cummins in them on this display of course i've got all of these 164th and many more if you guys ever wanted to see a uh, just a video on that um let me know about that i got some st i'm not going to do the trucks i'm just going to kind of show you the display but um got all that give you a little bit of a close-up on some of the weathering jobs that's been done here that one's probably my favorite weathering job i just like that one a lot Another cool one's this one back here. <coughs> Excuse me. A couple other cool ones. My favorite little M2 car with drag. Ready for the drag track with the bully dog truck. Uh, but that's pretty cool. But what I just am working on now is this, which is my full farm or my little farm display. Um, you can start at the entrance here um, with the little grass pathway in between the track. Um, Real dirt, uh, as you can see, there's a little bit of a hill over there with a truck stuck behind it, you know, an old farm truck. Uh, one of our restored John Deere's up at the front. And I got some uh, some shrubbery and our little garden here. A few stalks of corn and uh, some other uh, little trees, lemon trees and apple trees and a bunch of other little things over there. Our Ford 8N and my custom uh, OBS flatbed. Um, got a little bit of grass with it. Um, my custom OBS, I love this thing. Um, and that's just sitting up here on the display. Probably my two favorite dually driver's trucks are the, the Ford, the maroon Ford, and that custom one I built there. Of course, we get some more trees and some of the machines in the back there. Our little cow pasture, I gotta build a gate or like a fence for, because I don't want them getting to the corn. I'm, I'm still unsure of if this is the end of this display and that's just some more corn for the garden. I don't even know. Um, the little cat tracked skid steer bringing out some hay. One of the cows looks like he's interested in it. Uh, got some of the other attachments over there and uh, our little fueling station. Um, this barn is completely scratch built. Uh, I just built it the other day. Uh, as you can see, all the framing and everything came out really, really good. Um, I am currently working on. Got to get that. There we go. I'm currently working on detailing out everything um, because uh, I want as much detail in this display as I possibly can. All right, I guess that's gonna go like that. Um, yeah, like I said, I just want as much uh, cool stuff as I can fit onto this display uh, as far as detail-wise. I did detail out one of the tractors, uh, which you can see here. It's just kind of a greasy, dirty mess. I took the duels off of it. This is the Authentic Series uh, by Ertl. I pulled the, uh, the duels off of it thinking that it's going to look a little bit more appropriate for a small farm like this. Oh, uh, yeah, I got to... I gotta somehow get this barn uh, onto the display and sticking on there. Um, of course, the Ford, there's nothing new about the Ford. It's just got some hay bales in the back, and I dirtied up the tires a little bit from driving around. Um, but that's about it, guys. I just really wanted to get a quick aerial shot 
of uh, the junkyard as well, as you can see. Uh, just my 164th table. I got the 150th table over there, so I figured the 164th deserved their own little thing. But this has been my little passion project for the last couple days, so I just wanted to show you guys. Thanks for watching.